So this is a white bass. This is a large bass. We do one dissection lab in this biology class for non-science majors. It brings the lecture into real life for my students. When they're studying for their exam, they're not just looking at notes on a page, they're remembering this lab. And when I ask, where would you find this structure, they're able to, to identify it, not just from a, a two-dimensional book, but from a three-dimensional reality dissection. I'm actually an English major. And I'm taking this class for my gen ed, but I'm actually enjoying it, So, and I didn't think I would. So yeah, it's exciting. I love dissections. I've always liked dissections, and I guess it's kind of nice that it's not formaldehyde, so it's not stinking as much. He did say it would smell fishy, but it really doesn't. It's not that bad. And I mean, I've never touched a fish before, so it's pretty cool. I've always had an aversion to the formaldehyde fixed, awful preserved specimens that you purchase for a lot of money. So what I did is I got a couple of friends of mine and recruited them to collect fresh fish. We have a lot of different species, uh, white bass, largemouth bass, uh, some perch. These are just like they were when the fish was alive and when any animal was alive. So it's a much more realistic. The color is the same, the texture is the same. Uh, this is a this is a true true dissection as it should be.